Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Hey guys, so today I'm bringing you, of course, the best glass screen protectors for the Galaxy S21 Ultra and the Galaxy S21, and that is the Whitestone Dome Glass. Now, of course, you know, I've always used these ones. I really just love, love, love the quality of them. Links will be in the description down below, but if you want the best glass screen protector, the ability to actually scan your fingerprint with out needing a hole punch or whatever things that like a lot of screen protector companies do a lot of weird things because they can't get the fingerprint scanner to work with theirs these do perfectly work with it you also got uh back protectors for the cameras so does this have a little bump sure so if you want to protect that you might want to get one of these too so we're going to go ahead and set this up on my ultra I am gonna put on the S21 at a later date. So let's go ahead and put these on and see just how it is. Now I will speed up the video when I do this, but they do have a step-by-step -step instruction if you want to install it yourself. Now let's get to it. All right, guys, so now we are finally ready. The screen protector is on. It does look pretty good. Again, I've always loved this brand just because it just does so well. Very different setup though. Very fun. I don't know if you did see that uh, how it happened, but it was pretty funny. Um, and I have that on here. You can really see it right by the camera. And then of course, I also put this one. Now the back protector is a little bit more glossy than the regular one so just know that that if you do want to go with this uh, protector it's going to protect your glass in the back which is of course good but it is a bit more shiny than um, how it is out of the box so now we have to set up our fingerprint scanner and set up something so that we can use a glass screen protector so first thing you're going to do is go to display go all the way down and then go to touch sensitivity. You're gonna change this on. So that will make it so it's a lot better off in your touches or else it will not work as well. And then you're going to go to biometrics and security and you're gonna re-register your fingerprints. So I'm gonna put in my super secret password and then we're going to put in our fingerprints. So basically just add one. You can start deleting the others. Um, save one just so um, if you did use fingerprint scanning for anything else, it is gonna still be active. So now I'll just do it. And with this one, you do not have to put the same kind of pressure that you used to on older devices, which I really do appreciate. As I say that, of course, it's actually asking me to put more pressure, but. Has a harder time with index fingers, I've noticed, comparing to a thumb very easily, but I'm gonna remove the first one since again, that was our old one. And now we should be able to 
have that. Boom. Very simple, very easy, very quick. And something that again is just so convenient about this glass screen protector. So yeah, guys, this was Whitestone Dome Glass Screen Protectors. Now they do have something new, which I'm not gonna put on, but I did wanna mention it called the S-Cushion. And the idea behind this one is that with the S-Cushion, you kind of put them on the back of your phone. So basically you put them on the back like this. And the idea behind it is you have a little bit more cushion if you don't want a full uh, style case, but you just want the glass in the front. You protect the back with this nice cushion, so if it hits the back of it, it should basically temper that. But not only that, it actually has basically a built-in cleaning cloth, so you can always take the top part off and then clean your screen. So yeah, that's the new S-Cushion that they are also offering, and you get that free uh, with this version of the screen protector. So yeah, guys, let me know what you thought in the comment section down below. I definitely like how quick it is. I definitely like how easy it is. Let me know in the comment section what your thoughts were. Thank you as always for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, why don't you go ahead and subscribe up there. Make sure you follow us on social media right here. And of course, check out our latest video up there. And right down here, you're gonna find the perfect video for you. Or at least that's what YouTube tells me. Thanks again.